Here we're covering another symbol function problem where they give us a random symbol, in this case, this one here, which we can call, well, whatever we want to call, I'll just refer to it as symbol. And they tell us what the symbol does as a function, and then they want us to evaluate or solve for that function with these numbers right here, or this input. So what does this mean? Well, it tells us that C is the first number they give us, and D is the second. And this symbol right here, well, it equals this expression, which basically means that this symbol takes the first number C, multiplies it by 4, that's what this means right here, and then we add that to 10 times the second number D. So in other words, this symbol is a shortcut for this process. So now we just plug in what we're given. And now you can see that 10 is C and negative 4 is D. Plug this in, we get 4 times 10, which is C, and then add that to 10 times negative 4. 4 and 10 is 40. We're adding that to 10 and negative 4, which is negative 40. Notice that these two are opposites. If we add them up, we will get our answer, which is 0. Alright, more to come.